It's all said and done But when our time winds up I bet it all on us All my friends pulled up for good vibes We know that the good vibes could be gone to some Growing up, I knew a few types of girls. For example, the preppy girl, the sporty girl, the visco girls, and the oatmeal girls. Yes, oatmeal girls. You know, the ones with those aesthetic Instagram feeds with thousands of bowls of beautiful oatmeal? I really looked up to those people because I've always dreamed of being an oat lover, but oatmeal only ever tasted good when I drenched it in maple syrup or made pancakes out of it, then proceeded to further drench those in maple syrup as well. I thought that's just how life was. My relationship with oatmeal would only ever be a mediocre relationship. Like, we know each other, but we never got close type of thing. But over time, well, it took her a little time to warm up to me. Oatmeal's true taste and personality really began to shine through. I realized there was more to her than sloppy, soupy beigeness, and there was an entire magical world hidden beneath the surface with thousands of opportunities and tastes and textures to explore. And this just shows you, there's an oat recipe out there for you. Keep your heart open, because you never know, if it happened to me, it could happen to anyone. Love finds you when you least expect it. Anyways, berry oats. I see these everywhere. People putting frozen berries and fruits into their oats, transforming them into this beautiful blue concoction. Now, I've tried it a thousand times, and it's just never sweet enough for me. Ooh, it's so pup. Just a taste mountain of blueness. This is not sponsored, it is just life-changing. Select protein powder, everyone. Blame Stephanie Buttermore for this obsession, but I'm not kidding when I say this protein powder was the catalyst for Oatmeal Linda to really shine through. It just adds sweetness, flavor, thickness, fluffiness, beautifulness into my oatmeal and into my life. And it's one of the best purchases I've ever made and I will continue to make for the rest of my life. It's not chalky, it's not gross or too strong, it's just right. Also, I just have to say, these balls literally took my breath away so good. Like, so, so much better than the store-bought granola bars or the store-bought balls. These balls won't let you down. Let's eat a ball. Mm. It's like a peanut butter oatmeal cookie. Recommend. Okay. You can get like a spoon and flip this. I don't think it works like that. I think it's like shut. No, this one. This one's also shut. Oh. 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 Oh, it's really easy. <laughs> what? Oh, I'm so excited. Matcha oats. Matcha this, matcha that. Matcha is taking over the world. I have never made my own matcha anything, so the taste took me by surprise a little bit. I was not expecting it to be that bitter. Even after dumping the whole maple syrup bottle into the bowl, it was still bitter. I'll work on my matcha relationship, and one day I'll learn to love you too. Ooh. I don't think you're ready for this jelly. Like matcha? This is awesome. A 7 out of 10. Even matcha is a little bit bitter for me. I'm just a bad man. Blessed by the good man. I almost killed you. Marley, you're in such a dangerous place right now. You're gonna keep it in the butt. Can't seem to accept it. But want to embrace it. So we wanted to experiment with an oat bean creation, so we subbed some flour for some oat flour, and I was pretty freaking impressed. Like it was really, really good. Wow! Check out these oat beans. Was it hard to make? Hard. Ooh! Oat bean. Mmm. How's And this is what I mean, guys. Never underestimate the power of oats. <laughs> Myla, does it smell delicious? No, sir. Mm. Oatmeal beef success. Let me give you a little bit of an update on my yoga and headstand progress. Yoga is now one of my favorite ways to take care of myself. I'm literally transforming into a basic yoga and oatmeal lady woman, and I'm not complaining about it. <laughs> and my headstands, you know, they're they're good and bad days. They're so good. That was 
so rough. Other than yoga and oats, there are a few other ways I've been trying to take better care of my health, and this is where I want to thank Kara for sponsoring today's video. I've seriously been using Kara for almost six months now, and it's such an easy way for me to know I'm taking care of my body, especially because Kara products are formulated with clean ingredients that are backed up by science. I've been deficient in iron for as long as I can remember. My doctor has recommended I take it for the past seven to eight years, and it's so convenient that Kara includes my iron pill in every little personalized packet, which are also made of eco-friendly compostable film that you can find more information on how to compost at takecareof.com slash p slash eco. So yeah, you literally just take a short five minute quiz, answer easy questions about your diet, your lifestyle, and health needs to address your specific wellness goals. You know, these past few months, it's been a really stressful time for everyone, but that shouldn't be an excuse for you to not take care of your body. Small routines like getting up and drinking a glass of water first thing in the morning, taking your vitamins, doing a five minute yoga practice can really go a long way in helping you prioritize you. So take the quiz using the link below to see what vitamins and supplements Care of recommends for you and get 50% off your first order with my promo code LINDASUN. Also, the daily challenges on the packs literally just give me life. <laughs> Oh, yeah, no. Anyways, I was skeptical of these zucchini oats because there was a substantial amount of zucchini I just plopped into those oats, but I had to get my veggies in this week somehow, and honestly, this oatmeal looked kind of really, really insane. Hey, this looks way too insane. Let's see if we can taste the zucchini. Wait. I mean, if you really try to taste it, I don't think you can. Solid! Ooh. 9.5. Yeah, so I was really desperate to find ways to eat more veggies this Balls week. Are so good. Crazy. So I decided to make fried still cut oats, like fried rice, but fried oats instead. Honestly, it looked extremely unappetizing, but I sprinkled some green onion and sesame seeds and it helped disguise the yucky texture, but it was nowhere near it fried looks rice. pretty good. Okay, let's try it. Mmm, it's pretty good. Okay. It kind of just tastes like chicken and vegetables covered in like some type of 7 out of 10. Oh, oats make you so full. Oh, it smells so... This is the best flavor. Oh my god. Oh my god. You need this. It's my mom walking Milo. So cute. So there has been some controversy on my channel recently. It's honestly been making me question my existence, my purpose, my message. I've addressed it before, but I feel like I have to address it once more. Change and growth is a part of life, and sometimes we just need to take a break to find ourselves to try new things, and that's a part of growing up. So me and Pancakes have been going through a little bit of a rough patch recently. I'm not gonna lie, we've been on a little break. But I think the relationship was getting a little bit too obsessive. And while they brought me so much happiness, and they were there for me when no one else was, and I'm so grateful for my protein pancakes for really making such an impact on my life and so many people's lives, but it's not an official breakup. We're still friends, and if it's meant to be, it's meant to be. And if it's not, well, I still have my oatmeal. Um, so. Excuse me, this looks so good. I don't think I put enough almond milk. It's just slightly hard. It smell like alcohol. Come here. Oh, it's cold. I'm gonna wear this after I eat, because all I can taste is the alcohol. Love it. Peanut butter and jelly. Jelly and peanut butter. Happy Women's Day, Milo. So yes, this is me making those famous three ingredient, you know, healthy or whatever oatmeal cookies. Hi. We're gonna need some pineapple. And if we're all gonna be honest right now, they kind of suck. But for being three ingredients, they're all right. Bananas could have been riper. It's not oatmeal, but I want to eat it. It's all about diversity. It makes me know Okay, this is something I've always wanted to try but was just too skeptical about, egg white oats. You just pour in the egg whites and mix it aggressively and this beautiful fluffy creation comes out and I added my protein powder because I'm obsessed and it's just so good. And the protein in this bowl is almost three chicken breasts worth of protein. Like, I'm very, very the impressed. Thing is, it already wasn't too good of a presentation and then like him saying that just like made it even worse. Mmm, so fluffy. For some veggies. Uh -huh. mm. I'm finding out the winners to let you know if I won or lost. The feeling we lost. Oh. Do you know mess? That's all that matters. So the first group, coffee cream. Oh. 
losers chocolate. The idea that, that our bodies are our value means that we are forever dependent upon men to validate us. We're, we're dependent upon an outside source to say that we are important, to say that we are valuable. I could go on for hours about how oats are seriously so good for you and your body and list dozens of health benefits because they seriously are amazing for you and personally, my favorite part is that they just keep me so full and give me so much energy throughout the day. Oats are packed full of complex carbs that slowly release throughout the day and they contain soluble fiber that helps keep you full and helps, you know, with bathroom times. They even help lower your blood pressure and control blood sugar levels, but truthfully, the list of health benefits is endless. Basically, I don't like to be hungry and oatmeal helps keep me full for hours. Hours, and when I'm full, I'm happy. So it's like a win-win. <laughs> Overnight oats was like my jam in grade seven and eight. I would demolish like two a day, but it's seriously a different game when you add my protein powder into it. Oh my gosh, it's like thick and sweet and creamy and dreamy. It's amazing. These are so good. Way better than the oat things you buy that are like $14. Back on the topic of my overnight oats, it did take a few tries for me to get the perfect texture because I didn't know with protein powder you needed to add more liquids, but you gotta make mistakes to learn. Oh my goodness, this was made with peanut butter protein powder and it just tasted like brownie batter for breakfast. What more could you ask for? Very thick. I don't know why, like every time I make overnight oats, it gets so thick. Oh my god, that is so good. Mm. It literally tastes like peanut butter brownie batter. Mm. The fact that there are long lineups at DQ indicates that there is significant demand and an opportunity for local Okay, I saw these baked oats being made with an air fryer and I literally could not not do it. So we blended up the oats and seriously just popped it in the air fryer and voila, a masterpiece. Innovative. Oh, the risen the butter on it. Oh, this looks so good. Oh, wow. It's like a cake. Freaking delicious. Let me come try it. Oh, for sure. Nine out of ten. Give it ten. Give it nine. Protein powder. I can eat the whole thing. Want another bite? Yes. <laughs> Wow. Ah. Mm. You didn't even eat it and you said mm. No. Do you want me to just make you guys one? They really like it. I'm gonna make you one right now. Now, this is just the most creative thing I've ever done. Oatmeal pizza crust, literally so easy. Really nervous about this pizza. Four ingredients and you just bake it, add toppings. Now, I made my crust a little thick, but I seriously will be making this again because it was just so easy. And the pesto, speechless. It was amazing. Oh, it smells so good. Oh yeah. Mm. Never had pesto pizza. So good. So I was interested to see if only eating oats would affect my hunger or energy levels and surprisingly, I felt freaking amazing. I'm not telling everyone to switch to an only oatmeal diet, that is definitely not what I'm saying, but I felt really energized, really strong, extremely satiated, and I'm someone who could eat breakfast foods and sweet foods for every meal, so I actually really enjoyed this week, and so did my taste buds. And the last two balls! And I was still able to smash all my Caroline Gerben workouts, and that's basically all I care about. <laughs> now, presenting to you the best oat recipe of my life. Okay, it's a little bit sticky. Very sticky. Uh-oh, I don't know if it's gonna work. Uh-oh, more flour. I think I added too much flour now. Frick. Okay, okay, I think this is a better texture. Ugh, frick. Hey, what the frick? This is much harder than the video. Come on, Linda, get it together. Get it together. Okay, lovely. Brush it. She rolls. <gasps> Stop, this is crazy. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my goodness. What? This is really happening right now. Hey, okay. Hey. This is a cinnamon bun. My cinnamon bun. Do we see that? Whoa. Okay, this is way too insane. Oh. 
No way! A 17 out of 10. No way! No way, no way! Did you see this? Nutritious delights. You're crazy. Oh my. Oh my. Oh my god. Perfect lightness, but denseness. No, this is the best thing I've ever made in my entire life. I'm literally serious when I say you have to make this. I think I like this more than Cinnabon. What's happening? This is literally freaked up. Oh. Last bite. You get so alone sometimes. Let's shred this. Here is me trying to get in some more veggies, and I had pretty high hopes for this one. And you couldn't taste the veggies at all, which was great, but you also just couldn't taste anything at all. It was kind of like eating flavorless oats, so this was kind of a fail, but it's okay. Failure is part of the oatmeal journey. Just accept it and move on. Not the prettiest meal. It's okay. There's seven. Blocking taste. So, I like to see oatmeal as a blank canvas, a blank sheet of paper, a 2,000 word essay that hasn't been written because with oats, the possibilities, guys, are just endless. The oatmeal itself is just the beginning, and you get to create your own masterpiece. You choose the types of oats, baked overnight, microwave, stove top, air fried, made with milk, water, or cream. You control the thickness, thinness. You decide what you love. Then the toppings, that's when you get creative, and you make your oatmeal yours, from dried fruit to every nut butter on the planet. Chocolate, yogurt, Nutella, peanut butter, granola, berries, more peanut butter, bacon, seeds, just plain, or even more peanut butter. There's no right or wrong when it comes to oatmeal. You do you, and you own it. Oatmeal is more than just a breakfast food. It's a way of life. So, I did finish all the oat balls from the beginning of the week, and I wanted to try a protein version of these balls. And I was hoping for the best, but I used a different type of protein powder than I do in my oats, and something was just off. I don't know. Okay, pre-workout, I'm just gonna... This just proves to me that my protein powder is superior to all. It is last day. I'm on a boat, too quiet for fame, but too wild for honor roll. Too poor to claim that I'm too rich for drama, though. If she want brain, I'm too quick, I'm at it all. If she gonna play, I can't say... The only thing on my mind when I was working out was chocolate and strawberry, so I thought, why not experience the air fried oats again, except this time, chocolate fried. It smells so good. I don't know how to check if oats are ready or not. And I swear, baked oats turn out so much better in the air fryer than in the oven. Just the texture is just immaculate. Not too dry, not too wet. Perfection. Crazy! This is lovely. I never really understood the oatmeal obsession until now. Like 14 million ways to eat oatmeal. We've all seen it. What is it called? Nice cream? I've never tried it before because I never believed ice cream, like real thick, creamy, sweet, and delicious ice cream could be supplemented by bananas. I don't know. But I found a banana oatmeal cookie ice cream or something recipe, so I thought, fine, let's do it and be disappointed, but I was actually quite surprised. And I also made a little chocolate brownie oatmeal mug cake to go along with the nice cream because why not? Delicious. Look at this creamy texture. And to celebrate us nearing the end of this oatmeal journey together, cake batter overnight oats made with cake pop protein powder. Whoa! Look at my birthday cake oats. Oh. Oh. Nobody's birthday. But we're celebrating oats. <laughs> <laughs> what did I wish? Wish brother's arm will get better and that Milo loses some weight and my neck can feel normal one day. Protein powder is linked below. Cake pop protein powder, the best thing I've ever tasted in my entire life. There's like no difference between this and a cake. Mm -hmm. Except this is better. Love Alarm season two is out. Milo. Stop it!
I'm actually lost for words how impeccable this protein powder tastes. I crave it every day. It's my first thought in the morning. I'm not even embarrassed about it. Editing my video. <laughs> my video. What is this? My video is done. <laughs> no, I can watch K drama. Over my life, I've learned oatmeal can be for everyone. You can eat it warm, cold, in pancake form, in pizza form, baked, blended, being dino egg oats. There are oats for everyone. For a long time, no part of me wanted to love oats or the way they tasted, but you just gotta find ways to make your oatmeal bowl yours. Good morning, good morning, good morning! Just need to find my Wow, so nice to get fresh air in the morning. The sky is so blue, the sun is out, it's not too cold. It's good morning. You know what? Live life like an oatmeal bowl. It's yours to create, change, be adventurous, take risks, add new toppings, take away toppings. We all have moments where we just want a plain bowl of oats by ourselves, and other times we want to go all out. Stuff the oats with peanut butter, Nutella, and every berry in the world. Sometimes we want it to be aesthetic, or thicker, or thinner. There is no right answer to how to do oatmeal right just like there's no right way to live life right. But don't be afraid of all the endless possibilities and don't be intimidated by those professional oatmeal Instagrammers who have prettier or more put together and thicker oats than you have. Maybe they do have nut butters that you're jealous of, but don't be embarrassed of the oats you love. Love what you love. Slay Elvis. Love what you eat, embrace your differences and see the world that way, your body that way. Live your life that way because there's no perfect oatmeal recipe for everyone. Add to a large mix. Do you think this is too small? You see, there's a reason why we always think our oatmeal recipe is the best, because it's ours and personalized for us. And wouldn't that be a beautiful thing if we could think about our bodies and our lives and measure our worth the same way? Just love it because it's ours? Wow, darn it. It's, it's, it, what do I do? So many unnecessary steps. Goodbye, Lord. Shit, I can't. So oatmeal isn't just a bowl of goopy grains, okay? It's a bowl of endless opportunities that we should accept and welcome, make it our own, and learn to love. Yup, who knew oatmeal could be so freaking deep and uplifting? So moral of this video, live and love your life just like a bowl of oats. Go make yourself a bowl right now. I love you guys, and yes, even more than I love oatmeal. And remember, we got this.